Hey all, welcome to the Conda Di Serving Studio. Hope everyone is doing good, staying safe. And if you have not yet subscribed to Conda Di Serving Studio, please do subscribe for Conda Di Serving related videos, discussions, topics. So this video is going to be a general topic, especially for someone who is looking to work in India. It could be someone who was already in India or someone who is abroad and who wants to come back to India. to work in the quantity surveying field so this is especially for you so if you're someone from any other country then i believe this wouldn't be that much suited for you but still if you are also someone who wants to work in the indian construction industry then definitely you can watch this video and anyways this is going to be a general information and maybe in the future this could be applying to your country also wherever you are working also so the topic that i would like to discuss is about how the different mncs are opening up a different department or they are setting up teams that would be catering to the other countries for example if if there is an mnc and they are having offices maybe across the globe maybe 10 or 20 offices all around the world including india so right now what is happening is the trend that what i'm seeing is they are opening a separate department and they are recruiting people in that department and they are going to be supporting the other 10 or 15 officers that are across the other countries like the uk the middle east us europe so they they would be the team that would be in india would be supporting them especially for the pre contract tasks because post contract it definitely there are some limitations there would be difficulties but still there are possibilities of doing some kind of pre post contract tasks like variation analysis or eot preparations material reconciliation so this also could be outsourced to that indian team so this is a huge opportunity that is coming up uh, there is a huge scope in it so if you are someone who is looking to change from your current role maybe you would be working in indian project so if you want to get some international exposure then this would be the right time or if you are someone who have done or who are currently pursuing your higher studies in another country and if you see that if you feel that nothing is working out in terms of job opportunities then this could be a opportunity for you to come back to india and start researching more about this start looking to get into such kind of teams in an mnc so what can you do to you know get into that kind of role or profile definitely you need to have that quantity take off skill you need to understand how to read drawings that is a basic requirement for any qs role not only Uh, this outsourcing job any any kind of qs role that is a must but in addition to that what you can do is you need to learn all the standard methods of measurement the international standard method of measurements like the nrms the new rule of measurements we have the pomi pomi is the rules it is not a structure but uh, many uh, middle east or the uk europe uh, projects they follow the pomi rules then smm7 is actually not being used right now it has been replaced by nrm but still if there are pdfs available online you can just go through it and understand the different sections where each type sections come uh, what all are the items that comes in that sections in each sub sections and how do you make the description for that boq what are the rules what are the things that will be included uh, that will be not included what will be the unit of measurement so all these are exclusively detailed in the, all these types of measurement of methods of measurement then there is ssm4 which is specifically used for infrastructure projects so you can go through that also the different sections used in that then there are also some country related method of measurements like arm uh, agreed rule of measurement i think this is used in ireland mainly so if you go get an idea about this then definitely definitely if you are going for an interview for this kind of role the interviewer is definitely going to ask you questions about 
whether you know about this international standard method of measurement and have you ever at least if you have not used if you tell to them that you have the knowledge about it uh, these are the kind of sections for this particular type of work and if you can impress in that way definitely the, you can get uh, opportunity in that company so the major reason as you can guess that rightly because the cheap labor available in india that would be the major reason why this kind of shift is happening this is already being carried out in the it industry now slowly this is getting developed into the construction sector also because easily the indian market can hire a number of qs who can look into that particular project and the timelines also will be critical so to complete for example when you receive a project that will be a huge project there will be the task of doing a cost planning in the initial stages like the concept design stage or the schematic design stage or the detailed design stage so you will have to do the quantity takeoffs and then do the cost plan preparation according to whatever standards and Mm, timelines will be very tight maybe it will be a big project uh, one or two weeks so uh, many number of resources can be used one person can look into the structural quantity takeoffs and preparing cost plan one can do the interiors architectural one can do the for mep M- mechanical one person can concentrate the electrical one person can concentrate plumbing another person can concentrate so a number of these tasks can be divided among different people and then the cost plan can be with proper coordination the cost plan can be prepared the rate analysis is still not being carried out by the indian teams because the market rates are not really known to them but still what is happening is there uh, these companies are setting up rate, rate libraries or a database of different rates in different countries of different items so when this is slowly created these rates can be usefully used for your rate analysis also the pricing can also be done from india itself but then that it would be a risky a proper review should be done by the counterparts in that particular country because the rates you know can fluctuate uh, depending on a lot of reasons so if you are someone who is interested in this kind of role who is in india especially or who wants to come back to india give me a shout give me a, send me a message in linkedin maybe i can be of help i can maybe refer your cv to a few companies that are already doing such kind of works so thanks a lot for watching this video hope this was a informative video something related to new role job opportunities the scope so if you found it to be useful do like it to share with your friends so are look looking to change their current role to change their current companies maybe it might be helpful for them and thanks a lot for watching this video take care bye